Hello everyone, I want to ask you one question and put your answer on the comment below. Do you know exactly how much you spent the last month? We are all so busy and we don't know how much we are spending on a monthly basis. But here is a simple thing that I do and you must try doing this. And at the end of every month, I download my bank statement and my credit card statement and put all of it in an Excel sheet and create this beautiful dashboard. Then I try to figure out how much I have spent and what is my unnecessary spending. This is the simple way to figure out all your expenses. So in this video, you learn to design your expense tracker. I am Sagar Banjade from ER.pedia. Now without any delay, let's get started. Open your Excel file and write all your expenses in the data sheet. We need another sheet in order to create the dashboard. You can even change the tab color by pressing the right key here and in this tab color from here you can change the tab color also. First we need the unique category. From this category we need to select our unique category. Copy this one and paste here. Category. Now re stay in this data so that we could create our unique category and uh, in this data sort and filter click on this advance here you need to select the copy to another location and check this unique records only and in copy to you have to select this category and when you enter the ok all your unique category will come here now we will design our dashboard so go to your dashboard i'll increase this size now select this two rows and in home click on this margin center and right here monthly expenses tracker dashboard. Make it bold, increase this font size and you can even change the background color, I will place a green. Here we need the start date and the end date. So type here start date and here end date. Now here type category and this one is amount. Now go to your data and copy this category and paste here. Copy this data will give the all border out to our data and increase this size copy this header and select the background color make them bold and center in this monthly expense tracker dashboard we track our expenses according to our start date and end date here uh, this is the expense tracker for 81 to 831 so type here You can even change this background color to. Now we need to get all the amount which we have spent in the insurance, food and dining in all this category. In order to get the amount from here, we have to type some formula. We use some ifs formula in order to get all our amount. Type here equal some if, go to the some ifs and click on this tab we need some range and this one is the sum range so select all these sum range here and give your comma now we need a criteria range one and our criteria range one is our category so select this category now give comma and we need a criteria one in order to give the criteria one go to this dashboard and select this category first sale of the category and we write the formula for the insurance so we have to select this insurance and again give this comma we need a criteria range to in this criteria range to we select this date so go to the data here and select this date again give comma we need a criteria to and criteria to is our start date 
so before selecting the start date we have to type give double quotation here and type here greater than or equal to and double quotation close and give impression signed and go to this dashboard and select this start date and log this start date by pressing F4 and done then again give comma and we need a criteria range 3 criteria range 3 is our in date before selecting in date we have to select the date so go to this data here and select the date again and give comma and here type double quotations now less than or equal to double quotation close and give impression sign and go to the our dashboard and select this in date log this cell by pressing yap 4 and close this bracket and our formula is ready now when you hit enter all your insurance amount will come in this c8 cell this is the beauty of this formula now you can drag it down and all this formula would copy to every cell now in order to make this dashboard more beautiful we need some icons so you can download the icon from the google or in the excel version greater than 2016 uh, you have the icon in this illustration part but this is my excel version 2016 so uh, the icons option is not available in this version so i have downloaded from the google and applied in my previous sheets so in order to save time i'll copy all this icon this is my icon now arrange all your icon like this and done now in order to get the amount just below our icon now first we need uh, to write the name of this all icon so in order to do that go to this insert and select this rectangular shape here and draw the rectangular shape and type here icon name and uh, you can make it bold and uh, in the format change this shape and shape outline no outline now again copy this and paste here and here we get the amount of insurance so in order to get the amount of insurance here in this formula bar type equal and select this insurance amount and hit enter your insurance amount is shown here now adjust its position and done now copy this two and do the same process for all all the formulas have been inserted now in order to remove all this grid go to this view and deselect this grid lines now we design a pie chart here in order to design a pie chart now select this data go to insert and here in the chart select this insert pie chart we can even change the layout of our pie chart by clicking on this quick layout select this layout according to your requirement i select this layout 6 now change this title to monthly expenses change this font color from here make it bold and increase its size to 16 done now our monthly expenses tracker dashboard is ready now when you change this date the so i'll type here i'll give the start date from 5 
when you hit enter the 5 now you will show the change of amount and the change of pie chart when you hit enter you will see all the data has been changed according to the our start date and the end date so this how you can track all your monthly expenses and figure out how much you have spent and what is your unnecessary spending in a month i think i have explained all the detail about the monthly expenses tracker dashboard now you can figure out how much you have spent in a monthly basis and what is your unnecessary spending if you still find it difficult to design this dashboard then let me know in the comment section if you have any excel related work then you can directly message on my instagram i'll place the link on the description so this much in this video thank you for watching this video